Shalom and welcome back to the YouTube channel of Pastor Paul Shufamaker and uh, now here I have a one new man Yemenite Shofa video 358 J size so this is the full polished uh, Shofa it will be a full polished Shofa afterward now it's still considered a horn to me because I have not shown the full potential or the potential of this particular horn to be turned into a shofar. So now let's look at it. Outwardly, I have a confidence in this horn. Very nice resonance. Yeah. And here it is. Uh, olive cream colors. See the colors are very nice. Shades of uh, dark brown colors with a long engraving done <coughs> Jews and Gentiles unite in the Holy Land let's move along you can see the borders here dark brown borders and uh, moving along you see the colors coming out the uh, maroon purplish colors dashes here and there faint uh, colors maroon purplish colors on the background of olive cream very nice clean out bell initial uh, basic tuning done we are going to fine tune the shofar before you today so on the reverse side see that nice colors nice patterns wow here see that the yeah, purplish, maroon purplish colors very nicely shaded lightly beautiful patches of it as you move on to the bell side you see some uh, grooves and things maintained uh, of the horn patterns maintained of the horns to just show you an inkling of the the horn patterns yeah but this is a full menorah a faithful uh, shofar yeah Yemenite uh, one new man shofar and uh, well we are here this particular shofar been tuned first stage and second stage let's hear the basic sound now Here goes heat tempering with an industrial heat gun up to about more than 600 degrees Celsius in order to soften or you say to temper the horn so that we can start to uh, shape the trumpet mouthpiece or the mini so called mini trumpet mouthpiece. And you hear the sound changes from stage one, stage two. Now I'm just pampering it. Yeah, don't put the, the hot air directly onto the horn of the because it will melt it. Okay, let's see. That's enough. Oops, still not, in, not, not hot enough. So, yeah, let's just speed it up. Some horn are harder, some horn are not that hard so then if you come with a harder horn then you need to temper it more but be careful not to melt it over temper then you got to have a lot of different uh, steps again to do okay see can you see from your computer or from your notebook
you're going to uh, got a window of about 30 seconds that's all before the horn hardens again so this is still the first stage here uh. first stage of fine tuning and you hear the sound changes already from the basic fine tuning Very hot. Let's uh, just cool it down a bit. Use my hand to just wrap it. <coughs> okay, let's see. Let's hear this uh, sec first stage of fine tuning. <coughs> tuning but uh, as I always do I find that it can go to a second stage of fine tuning and make it even more resonance and a clear sound for especially like shofars like this yeah some shofar has lower tone yeah mellow lower tone yeah that's what the bigger size which is a very commanding sound but this type is vibrant go 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 it doesn't it doesn't just hold back it goes yeah. I'm going to the second stage now. I have uh, make the cup inside here. It's like a bowl or a cup. Yeah, some call it barrel so that you can capture your breath in this area inside here capture it raise up the pressure and push it through the small hole here that we have drilled that it will produce a sound with the air moving from here to there very nicely for the sound to be generated from here from the bell side so now second stage of fine tuning <coughs> Still a bit hard, the horn. Just, uh, just send it down. Smoothing it down a bit. 320 waterproof sandpaper for sanding down the mouthpiece slightly so that it does not uh, like um, feel sharp to your lips if your lips are that. Uh, Tender and soft. Okay, this should be the final stage. Second stage fine tuning. sound commanding sound as we hear in a battle between two different team and even in the same army 
they will be signaling each other constantly so this is one of the sounds that is constantly heard clear vibrant commanding awesome sound so as you have heard this particular video 358 give us a like on this uh, video j size video and also subscribe to us if you have not for constant to receive constant updates of our posting of Shofa as what you see is what you get this is quite a nice length Shofa yeah G size so give us a positive comment and uh, J size would be uh, from after 42 inches right up to 45 inches it will be considered as a J size Shofa and also share with your friends that they also will be confident to see a shofar on a video to get a shofar on a video yeah and hear the sound of it so by doing so you will help us to enlarge our subscriber base and we'll be really appreciative of that thank you so much and uh, we hope to get uh, up to a thousand subscriber by end 2021 so thank you so much god bless you all and shalom